Round three. Round three starts off with me and the modern day grave digger taking on Ryan Monster Jam OCD and Son of a Digger. Oh. And I think you got it, Pinchy. Wow, I rolled over like that, but by a few tire lengths, I take out Son of a Digger. And look what's driving on to congratulate me. It's Grim Reaper's son, um, grave digger. Take take a look at that. Look who has come to congratulate me on my win. All right, let's move look on. Out. I got a rivalry after me. Will it be Tour Accurate, Max D, or Monster Mutt Rottweiler? Here we go. Oh, and that is a complete win. For Monster Mock Rottweiler! And Maximus has just passed out. Let's see if we can CP Har him back to life. What do we have here? Now Grimm and his gravedigger have sat in the same spot as Maximus did. Oh, sounds like he's really gonna route me on for sure, because there are no more Max D's in this race. What do you think is going to happen to Maximus? We'll find out, but let's move right. on. Here comes Bakugan Dragonoid taking on Hurricane Force Nitro Neons. And your winner is the Bakugan Dragonoid! Holy cow, this Bakugan Dragonoid is on a roll. Time Flies versus Avenger. Oh, what a rollover I saw by Time Flies! Oh, I did see a rollover. He crashed like this and then rolled into that side like that. Oh, but it appears that container had slowed down Avenger. Therefore, your winner is Time Flies. Oh, boy, oh, boy. He better hurry because time is running out. <laughs> you have that right. news travels fast versus Alien Invasion. Oh, it's Alien Invasion. Wow, what a great roll over the Triple Threat series ramp as that container has slowed down the bad news to going slow. Alright, and the last race of round three is Slinger versus Captain's Curse. And your winner is... It's Captain's Curse, I think. Yes, but look how Grim had fallen in like that. It looks like Grim has something to say about this, don't you? Nothing that much. Oh, well, still, we're going to need some fast losers. Have here, it appears Maximus has been revised. Because we're going to have some fast losers. And Maximus says, bring back Max D as a fast loser. Do you? Oh, we'll see about that. Because we're going to do it. Another four truck winning fast loser. And it appears we're going to need two fast losers to make it an even bracket of the quarterfinals. So... Our four truck brackets going to be with Max D, Bounty Hunter, Son of a Digger, and Crustacean. Because I feel like giving Riley McCord another chance. Whoever wins this round will go definitely into this slot for the quarterfinals. And then we got a bracket set up for truck number two of the Fast Loser. It'll either be 1996 Grave Digger, Sasquatch, Grave Digger the Legend, or Ice Cream Man. We'll start with this Ama. Um, uh, Fast loser bracket. Let's get started. Bounty Hunter versus Max D. I think it's Bounty Hunter. We're going to take a look at this. And yes, it is going to be Bounty Hunter. Maximus has had his last chance. What has he got to say about that? Oh, he's bringing on that Max D. Oh, and he's destroying it. Oh, and Max D over here is going out of control, shoving into Maximus. Shoving into Maximus. And it looks like that is going to be it, that no Max Ds are going to come back either way. Still, Bounty Hunter wins, but it was something seeing a pretty jealous Maximus. Max D had his last chance, but we're going to see keep going. Red Crustacean by Riley McCord versus Son of a Digger by Monster Jam OCD. Son of a digger! Oh man, and this was Riley's very final chance into getting into the fast loser spot, and that goes to Son of a Digger. All right, and our fast loser will either go to Awesome Dalgren and Bounty Hunter, or Ryan Mazajim OCD and Son of a Digger. Your fast loser is Son of a Digger. All right, 
That's a very good run. And now we've got one truck in to fill in as a fast loser. All right, on to fast loser bracket number two, 1996 Grave Digger versus Sasquatch. Oh, I think Sasquatch puts on his stamp of approval. He sure does, as the 1996 Grave Digger has rolled backwards, giving Sasquatch the win. We do have one more Grave Digger to try to have a chance. It'll either be Ice Cream Man or Grave Digger the Legend. And, oh, oh Ice Cream Man, I think that's gotta be Ice Cream Man. Oh, and I forgot to move Sasquatch out of the way. But Sasquatch is still prepared for the championship round, as Ice Cream Man will go up against Sasquatch, winner of that race... Will be the final fast. Your loser. final fast loser is. I think it's Ice Cream Man. Yes, it is. It is Ice Cream Man going in as the fast loser. That was a very fun two fast loser brackets to make it an even quarterfinal bracket. They put up their best effort, but they are now eliminated as we are now officially down to eight trucks. Let's get our quarterfinals underway. Looks like this is my last chance. We got. Me and the modern day Grave Digger taking on Monster Mutt Rottweiler. Oh, oh you're paying it off, Pinchy. You won. Oh, it looks like I did. Even though I veered off to the left, bringing them a little bit more together, the winner is me. And Grim's Grave Digger comes in to congratulate me, giving me some encouragement. He's going to try to probably give me a boost. Here's another battle of another pair of two fast trucks. It's either Time Flies or Bakugan Dragonoid. And it is Bakugan Dragonoid! Wow, now how about this for a very fast truck? Captain's Curse Glow versus Alien Invasion Nitro Neons. The last of the glow and the last of the Nitro Neons. And it's Alien Invasion because Captain's Curse rolled backwards! All right, what a really good win that was. That Triple Threat Series ramp sure does like to pull these trucks backwards. And the final, fa and the final race in the quarterfinals will either go to Ryan and Monster Jam OCD in Son of a Digger or the Ice Cream Man. And it is the Ice Cream Man. Cream on the inside, clean on the outside, a block for the ice and an ice cream man. Moving on to the semifinals. We are now narrowed down to four of the fastest trucks. We got myself in the modern day Grave Digger. Monster Jam Action 81 is in Bakugan Dragonoid. And I believe John Cadillacs is who is in Ice Cream Man. And in Nitro Neon's Alien Invasion is Chase to Star. Let's do this. We've definitely seen these two race. Either Grave Digger or Bakugan Dragonoid are very both winningest drivers, but there can be only one truck to take home the gold. So who will it be? Me or Monster Jam Action 81? Here we go. And it is Monster Jam Action 81 in the Bakugan Dragonoid. And that is a pass out for the Grim. Grave Digger is down and out. Mostly Alien Invasion has been the fastest truck so far, but I did end up bringing Ice Cream Man back as the fast loser, so only one of these will get to face Monster Jam Action 81 in the back of Gone Dragonoid. Who is it gonna be? And it's gonna be the Ice Cream Man! Oh, and just by a flip, the Ice Cream Man is the right. winner. And it's now time to crown your sign-up series number 44 championship. Inside of Bakugan Dragonoid is the famous Hangouts crew member, Monster Jam Action 81 in the Bakugan Dragonoid. And in the delicious Ice Cream Man, we've got an Instagrammer, I believe, who goes by the name John Cadillacs, who is ready to crown our sign-up series 44 champion. And your son at Series 44 champion is... It's Monster Jam Match 81 in Bakugan Dragonoid! And there you have it. This was quite a tough run last time. Bakugan Dragonoid was so close at that time to his first ever championship run when LEGO Fan 506 drove it. 
But huge congratulations to Hangout's crew member on Hangout right now, Monster Jam Action 81 in the Bakugan Dragonoid, for taking this truck to victory. Looks like Maximus and Grim have come back because they either way this time, they would love to see their own trucks racing down my ramp. As they run right past the Bakugan Dragonoid. Was that a fun yeah. sign-up series or what? Oh, yeah, now yeah. There you have it very, very much. And congratulations once again to Monster Jam Action 81 in this beautiful Bakugan Dragonoid. And it's great to have these two Grave, this Grave Digger and Max D on the track. Thank you for enjoying our sign-up series. And I believe I'd like to move my next sign-up series to February for the first of none other than Stadium Championship Series Yellow. So let's get ready for that. Next month, sign up series number 45. Thank you guys for watching. Until next time, this is Cameron at Pinchio Wait, signing and pinching out. Take care.